What's up guys, I am back on Skybounds and this is going to be kind of like an update video. There was an update last week and I'm going to be showing you guys everything that they've added. It's a pretty cool update. Um, I know it's been like a week since the update and I'm only just recording this now. But I've been busy with my team working on our island. We've been rebuilding our whole island. And I will make a, um island tour video when it's finished, but it's not done yet. So look out for that video in like a week or two. But yeah, I'm going to show you guys a little sneak peek of the island. I won't show you too much. That's all you get to see. Did you see that? Uh, I'll show you one more time. Okay, that might have been too much. You don't get to see any more. But yeah, it's going to be cool. The island is looking great. And yeah, be excited for that video. Anyway, back to this update. Now this is actually a really cool update, um, they added a new kit, a new loot pass, there is a new island in the war zone that we'll be looking at. They've also added polar bear spawners, um, these things called frost ore seeds and they've added pumpkins and they've also got three new custom enchants. So yeah it's a pretty good update, there's like lots of new stuff and if we have a look my kit should be ready so let's start off by claiming my kits. I've got my comet kit. What did I get? Two blaze spawners, two polar bear spawners, two emerald ore seeds, 30 mil. I never get any good money when I record. Like, I always get, like, really low. I never get anything good, and it sucks. So this is, like, a PvP kit, if you couldn't, like, tell by the name. The warrior kit. So it's like the builder kit. It levels up each time you claim it until it gets to level 10. So if we claim it... And we look in our mailbox. I haven't actually emptied my mailbox. So this is like, this was level 2, this was level 1. So it comes with like armor, swords, bows, um, potions, orbs of immunity. Oh yeah, they added orbs of immunity. Which is really good if you don't like PvP and you want to go to the war zone and not die. Um, my builder kit. I haven't been taking my pickaxes out. I've just got like, like loads of kit stuff in my PvE kit. Okay, what did I get? Uh, so this must have been my third time claiming the warrior kit because I got the level 3. And then I'm pretty sure after chain it goes to iron and then after iron it goes to diamond. So yeah, it's a pretty good kit. Also got to use my Santa set. Let's see if we get anything good. Iron, 2 seed silver, quartz, 2400 cobblestone increase, 3 sugar cane pages and 25 demon dust. That's not too bad. So I want to show you guys the new area in the war zone, but before I do that, I have a warrior loot pass. Um, I haven't done a loot pass before, so I have no idea how to do this, but I think it's going to be fun. So right click to activate this pass. Alright, you activated a loot pass warrior. Do passes to view all your challenge passes. Okay, so we have to do challenges to get the rewards. So slash passes. Okay, so challenges. Grind 100 chicken, cow, spider, zombie, pig. Good job limits just reset then because if I would have done this an hour ago, I wouldn't have been able to do this. So I've got my sword. I'm going to go kill those mobs real quick. Okay, so I completed that challenge, killing the mobs. The next task, parkour of plenty. Complete three different parkour courses. I hate parkour, but I can just do the three easy ones. The spawn parkour, the cave parkour, and the farm parkour. But first, let's open this confetti that I got from killing the mobs. And that is all trash. Okay, I'm at the spawn parkour. Let's see if I can flawless this. Okay, this is going well. Alright, checkpoint one. I almost have jumped that. Checkpoint two. This is the part I always fall on. I think they've made this easier. That jump felt way easier than it used to be. Alright, checkpoint three. I'm gonna flawless this. Never mind. I was going too fast. I should have slowed down. Really? 
How am I messing up this bad? This is like the easier part. What? Okay, come on. I need to slow down. I think that's the problem. I'm trying to go too fast. Okay, there we go. We did it. Then 1 minute 54. Okay, now we need to go to do the farm parkour, which is in the war zone. Hopefully we don't die. Here it is. This is like the easiest parkour. Hopefully I don't fail now I said that. Of course I fail now I said that. Okay, I think they might have made this one easier too. I am just really bad at parkour today. Why do I keep falling on that jump? I'm pressing the space bar. Okay, I got this. I believe. Yes. Okay. I'm not going to fall. I almost ran off. Yes, I'm almost at the checkpoint. Come on, one more jump. Yes, I made it. That was way harder than it should have been, honestly. I'm so bad. Alright, there's the first checkpoint. Now the rest should be easy. Yeah, I got this. There we go, parkour finish. Now we need to go to cave parkour and I've completely forgotten where it is. Okay, I'm at cave parkour. Let's see if I can do this one. This one's a little bit harder, I think, but hopefully it won't take too long. Did they make this easier too? It seems really easy. Never mind, I fell. I take it back. I need to stop saying it's easy. Every time I say it's easy, I fall. Okay. I've got this. This was the jump I fell on. Was it that one or was it this one? It was one of them, but I made it this time. The checkpoint is just over there. I always fall on that one. That one's a hard one. Sorry I'm not talking, I'm concentrating. I suck at parkour. I can't like talk and do it because I fall. Okay. I can do this. And then this part's easy. Yes, I'm gonna make it! I made it! Checkpoint one! Okay, now this one isn't too hard either. It's just I always hit my head over here. Yeah, I always hit my head on this jump. Okay, I did it. I'm almost at the end. Okay, I'm not gonna mess up this jump. I messed it up. Okay, I got it this time. Don't hit my head. Okay. I'm just gonna keep going. Yes, yes, I did it. Two minutes, 22 seconds, not too bad. All right, completed parkour of plenty. Next task, hostile territory. Discover a new war zone location. So, the new war zone location that I was talking about earlier. Let's slash one so someone doesn't come and kill me. But yeah. I guess we gotta go there now, which is the perfect opportunity for me to show you guys the new Warzone location. Before we go there, there's one other thing I want to show you guys. So, 
there's this guy over here, this NPC, that has a quest if you want to do it. Um, which I've already done in a previous video. But I'm going to right click him again because he's got something else now. So if we click him, we can buy immunity. Buy stonks. Elon will take your money and invest it. Cost 1 million stars. So we can buy an immunity from him. It doesn't say how long. If I think it's random. Like it just gives you like a random number of immunity. But you can buy it every day for a million stars. So let's see. 10 minutes and 42 seconds, that's pretty good. My friend did it earlier and got like 40 seconds, which sucks. Um, come back after the daily reset. So I can buy more immunity in like 24 hours. So the new war zone area, it is called Fosty Fortress and it costs 10 mil to unlock it. So let's click that and unlock it. And then we can do slash spawn, nope slash war zone. I don't even know what I'm doing. Uh, go to the war zone, we've now got immunity. How do we start the immunity? Do we just jump down? Wait, we need to see where it is. North. So north is this way. Oh yeah, it says above my hotbar. Immunity, 10 minutes, 42 seconds. I assume that starts when I jump down. So yeah, let's, there's a chest here. Anything? Of course not. Let's go check out the new war zone location. I'm not actually sure where it is because I haven't been here yet. Okay, I'm not seeing it. I think I went the wrong way. Okay, so let's run back. Actually, let's slash spawn, it'll be quicker. So, slash war zone. Did I even go the right way? I don't think I went the right way. Did I? Maybe I did. I don't know. This is definitely north. I'm sure it is. Did I go this way? I have no idea. I get so lost in the war zone. Because I, I honestly have no idea where it is. I know it's like a snowy area, an icy area or something. This has got like the polar bears and the um, frost ore seeds. I think this is it. There's like three bridges to it, I assume. Let's go on the middle one. North. Thanks, Kenzie. Farmer bot. We can use that on our island. Yep, here it is. Um, you found the Warzone hidden location, Frosty Fortress. We got a 15k stars for that. Um, we got an ore seed for that. I don't know what that was for. Loot pass, uh, completed, hostile territory, next task, PvP legend, kill 10 players. I'll probably get a friend to help me with that. But let's check out this area. So it's got some nice little buildings. I think they're buildings. It's a chest. Sneaky. Um, it's got... Oh look, these are the new frost ore seeds. Oh, it's got polar bears. Polar bears are really OP. Their loot sells for a lot. They've got the new frost ores. Um, there's a chest here. Nothing great. You know what, I'll take that. We need those. And I'll take the steak too. But yeah, so these are the new spawners. They added polar bears. And these are the new ore seeds, the frost ore seeds. And then they also added pumpkins, as you can see, you can farm pumpkins now. I don't need those though, so I'm just going to leave them there. Um, yeah, so it's a pretty cool place. Um, if you guys can afford to buy it, it's quite expensive, 10 mil. You should come and check it out. If you need immunity, you can get immunity at spawn, which is pretty cool. Anything up here? Have I got auto jump on? I feel like I have. Yeah. No, I don't. So why am I like jumping? Is it just because they're slabs? Probably. I hope I can like jump off this building when I get to the top. Um, because I don't want to climb all the way down this ladder again. I don't know why I took that XP. That was like literally no XP. How tall is this? Let's go up here. This must be the top, surely. Yeah, it is. This is pretty cool. It's a really good view from up here. Oh, wow. You can literally see everything. This is awesome. You can see the bridges. You can see the war zone. You can see this whole island. It's cool. 
I've just put some iron armor on and grabbed a diamond sword and I'm gonna go to the war zone and try and find 10 people because if we do slash passes I've got to kill 10 players and I would ask my friends to help me but they all seem to be afk we do this just gonna spam the clan chat no one's gonna reply because everyone's afk and of course everyone be afk when i need people to kill so i suck at pvp but i'm gonna go to the war zone and i'm going to try and kill 10 people it might not go well so yeah and there's a sky drop. Perfect. Time to go find some noobs. I'm gonna go try kill some nakeds, but everyone's gonna go invis. This is annoying. So I just gotta kill ten people. Ten nakeds. That's all I need to do. I wanna do the random TP. How do I do that? There. Get my rage ready. I need to eat. I feel so bad killing nakeds, honestly. I hate it. Oh, I can take this guy. He's got worse gear than me. Sorry buddy, but it's your chance to die. I can't kill this guy, what? Is he immune? I don't know. Oh, I'm immune. Immunity pause. Oh, this is annoying. I completely forgot about immunity. That was a waste of a rage. Anyway, let's do a random TP again. At least we didn't die. That's a good start. Well, we couldn't die because I was immune. So, anyways, hopefully all the nakeds are still looting chests. I don't even need to loot chests. I shouldn't waste my time. I can fight this guy. Come on, fight me, please. I am so sorry, but I need to kill you. I wish he looted that chest. Come back. Oh, this poor guy, he's just going to literally a death trap. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm going to say sorry in chat. Sorry. Okay, he had like nothing on him. I'm going to take his sword in case he comes back to kill me. Um, Now for our next person to die. Looks like it's going to be this guy. I am so sorry. Does he even have a sword? Can he even defend himself? I don't think he can. Oh, I feel so bad. I hate killing people. Where is he? Did he... Did he log or something? I don't know. Passes. I got two kills, so I did kill that guy. Oh, I feel so bad. I hate every part of this. I'm taking his food. So that's two out of ten. Eight more people to go. I hate this. I feel so bad. They're just innocent people trying to get loot. <laughs> This is evil. I'm going to kill this noob. I'm so sorry. I just completely missed. I'm going to rage just to catch up with him. Because I need the kill. Sorry. I feel so bad. I hate this. That poison scares me every time. I always think someone's behind me. And I like turn around and start swinging my sword. And it's just the poison. That guy's an iron. I don't really want to fight someone with gear the same as me because there's a chance I could die and yeah. No thank you. Should I kill this guy? Yeah, why not? Oh, oh I've already killed him. I can't. Oh, I can't kill the same guy twice. I feel too bad. I'm sorry. Need to find some nakeds. I don't mind killing nakeds over and over because they aren't losing anything. And it's for a challenge, so it's not like I'm just being mean. I'm sorry, I have to kill you. Oh no, now I'm gonna die to this diamond guy. Who is it? I don't know who it is, but now there's another diamond guy. Oh, you two can fight. Please leave me alone. Okay, I think I'm good. Um, I need like, what, six more kills? Can I do slash passes? Yeah, I'm good. Slash passes. Yeah, six more kills. This is taking forever, but we're going to get it done. Oh, there's a naked up there, but I can't bother to climb that. Come on, come down. Yes, come down. Yes. I can't rage. I hope they don't know I'm behind them. Oh, there's loads of people here. Am I going to get like... 
gonna come and kill the nakeds. Hello. Yeah, run. I saw you try and kill that guy. He had like nothing. That was mean. I'm sorry. I'm being killed by an invis. He really hurts. Really hurts. Ouch. Not gonna lie, that was kind of embarrassing. But it's whatever. I got five kills. I'm honestly proud of myself for getting five kills. Because I suck at PvP and I'm surprised I even got one. I wanna go kill that guy, but I know if I kill him, someone's gonna come after me. I'm gonna kill him. I wanna kill that other guy as well. I'm so sorry, but you have to die. It's not my fault, it's this server. It's making me kill people. I wanna kill you too. Oh no, oh no. Oh, I've already killed you, I'm not gonna kill you. I'm gonna take that guy's sword and his potion. Okay, four more people to go. Okay, I've gone in like a full circle and I haven't found a single person, so I think I'm gonna go do a sky drop. Oh, does this guy wanna fight? Huh, you wanna fight, huh? Yeah? Come on, fight me. No, you don't wanna fight? I don't wanna fight either. <laughs> You're probably gonna kill me. Oh, there's a scary person. Run! <laughs> If I run past spawn, maybe some people will jump down to fight. He's coming for me. He wants me dead. I'll just go to farm parkour. Unless he catches me first, which he might. Oh no. I didn't plan this well. Uh oh. I want to kill you though. I don't care if I die. I just want to kill you. No, you've gone on the parkour. Okay, so I've got a sky drop and I'm going to use it because I literally can't find anyone. So, let's do this. Nah, slash warzone. See if we can find ourselves some noobs. No idea where I am. Oh, I know where I am. Oh, there's an, there's an, there's an invis. Come back. Come back, I want to kill you. I can't be bothered to chase an invis, honestly. Yes, I am recording combo. Okay, need some noobs. Come on, noobs. I'm going for this chest, I really don't need to. There was nothing in there, I'll take the money I guess. There's nothing I need, but oh, I don't want to fight that guy, go away, I don't want to fight you. But you want to fight me, but it's fine, yeah, huh, destroyed, that's what I thought. Alright, how many more kills do I need? gonna gap or just in case. <gasps> There's a naked! Come here naked! I need to kill you! I'm so sorry! I need to kill you! You must die! I feel so bad. I feel so bad but I think I've killed this guy before. I'm so sorry. Did I kill him before? I feel like I did. I just completely messed up my sprint. You know what? It's okay because we're gonna kill him again! Oh, he has no idea. I feel so bad. I'm so sorry. Did he have anything worth uh, keeping on him? No, he didn't. Okay, I don't feel bad anymore. Three more people, I think. Uh, passes. Two more people. I got this. Hello. Let's fight. You could probably kill me because I suck that much and I don't have rage. But I'm going to fight you anyway. Unless I see a naked, then I'll go for them. Unless I've already killed them, then I'll feel bit bad. And now I've just messed up my sprint. Ah! They're going to run to farm. I really can't be bothered to chase. Oh, I'm going to chase anyway. But they're going to go to farm. Whatever. I'm going to kill... Oh, did I just kill this guy? I did. I'm not going to kill him again. I'm too nice. Hey, I see you. Yeah, ha ha ha. Okay, there we go. I'm gonna kill this guy now. Okay, I'm done killing people. I'm gonna get out of here. 
Okay, I can't believe I just killed 10 people. I only died once. It was embarrassing when I died because I died to an invis. But that doesn't matter. I did the challenge. I'm glad we got that one out of the way. That was not fun. I hate killing people. I feel so bad. I am very, very sorry to anyone I just killed. It was for a good cause. I had to do it for my challenge. Blame the server, not me. I'm sorry. Okay, so I can probably do the next challenge in spawn. Farm 250 wheat, potatoes, carrots, beetroot, and sugarcane. So... If we go to the farming islands, I can do it here. Shouldn't take too long. Shouldn't be too hard with all this wheat fully grown. Okay, I've done 488 wheat. That's way more than I needed to do. So now I can go and do the potatoes, which are over here. So I'm doing the potatoes. Once I've done the potatoes, I will go and do the carrots, the beetroot, and the sugarcane. But I'll probably edit most of that out for you guys so you don't have to watch me um, farming stuff for like five minutes because it was probably really boring to watch. Okay so I've done well over enough wheat, potatoes, carrots and beetroot. I just got to do the sugarcane so if we go to the sugarcane island which is over here can quickly farm 250 sugarcane. Looks like someone's been farming it um, which is kind of annoying but it's whatever. There we go, um, completed. Next task, frozen foxes. Find and feed five hungry winter foxes. So basically there's like um, foxes around the war zone and around spawn that we can go to um, for the challenge and we have to give them stuff. Um, I know there's one, I know there's four at spawn. Um, I don't know if there's any others at spawn and then I know where a few are in the war zone. So I need to find five so I can do four at spawn and then the one in the war zone. So I know there's one on this island. Um, I'm pretty sure it's over here. Yeah, here it is. They're super cute. Look at them. <laughs> so if I click it, the fox sniffs to see if you have some sugar. Okay, so let's turn this into sugar. Then we can give it to the fox. There we go, fox fed. So the next one is by lake under the apple tree. Where is the apple tree? Is this it? This is an apple tree. It's the wrong apple tree. Um, it's this one over here. So it's this fox. It wants an apple. I need to go and get an apple from my island. Okay, I've got some apples. Um, let's go find that fox again. Here it is. Fox fed. And then there's another one at the end of the spawn parkour. So we can just fly there instead of doing the actual parkour. Because we've already done it once today. We don't need to do it again. Um, is it? No, it's this island. No, this island? Yes. No? Uh, yes, this island. I'm so lost. Alright. The fox sniffs to see if you have some sweet berries. Alright, I've got some sweet berries. Let's feed the fox. Fox fed. And then there's also one at the market. Which is this way no it's over this way and it is right in the corner of the market here can i click it there we go the fox sniffs to see if you have some yellow dye um i can just buy that from the shop yellow dye fox fed so i need to find one more fox but i don't know of any others at spawn so the next one is in the war zone i know where the fox is we can just go and run and give it a water bucket real quick we're gonna put our immunity back on so we don't die with slash immunity play and then which way was it it was towards the ice spikes so it's past farm parkour behind the ice spikes in a fountain so got the water bucket we go past farm, there's the ice spikes, and then there should be a fountain over here. It should be in here, yeah, here he is. So the fox sniffs to see if you have some water bucket. Here we go, little fox. There we go. Um, loot pass warrior finished. Go to the loot area at spawn to claim your jackpot reward. Okay, slash spawn. What is the loot area? Oh, it's over here. Jackpot rewards. So, if we just click this. Loot pass warrior. Left click to open. 
Okay, so before I open it, I'm going to tell you guys what we can get. So, we can get Warrior Kit Unlock Token, which is the kit I showed you earlier. You can get Chat Symbol Sword, which I'll show you right now. Um, I already have the symbol. If you look next to my name, it's the little blue sword symbol. Um, we can get Warrior Prefix, which is like a blue, light blue prefix that says Warrior. Then we can get Sun Rank, Bolt Rank, Tornado Rank. One boost gem, three polar bear spawners, three frost doors, pumpkin farming book, crafting recipe, golden arrow or blaze war, or holiday feast or diamond gumball, 25 mil star note, 50 mil star note, enchant scroll, bleeding five or wisdom five, limit boost, 15k polar bear kills, 20k pumpkins farmed, 5k frost door mined, and that is all the things we can get from this. So if we click on it, left click to open up. Let's see what we get. We got the symbol, nice! That's going for like 500 mil at the moment. I'm pretty sure it was Blazing that bought me the loot pass. I'm pretty sure he got it for like 400 mil. So we can probably make profit off of that or I'll just give it to someone on the island that needs it. So if we have a look in my mailbox, I have a lot of stuff in here now. Um, I've got my warrior and builder kit. I've got my parkour chests. Um, from the parkour. When did I get free waterfall parkour chest? I definitely didn't do waterfall parkour. Maybe that was a reward for something. I don't know. Skill knowledge ticket, 3k grind and XP. Polar best spawner, frost door seed. Guillotine, enchant, scroll, iron boots, bleeding two. This must have been from the sky drop. 10k XP, 20 minute orb of immunity. Skill knowledge ticket, 200k, farming XP, free pumpkin pages, skill increase, 7,500 foxes, and a noble seed for the horse you'll never have. Wow, that's sad. So let's open these parkour chests, see what we get. So let's start off with spawn parkour. Um, 7k star note, steak, seed silver coal, and a spawner shard cow. Trash, but what do you expect? It's the spawn parkour. Now for farm, probably won't be anything good out of this either. Stone legs, potion, star note, which is really bad, and farming page, carrot. Now for the cave parkour chest. Enchant scroll, divination 2, wheat seed, spawn shard zombie, and a spider spawner. Not too bad. And then let's open these last three waterfall ones together. Maybe we'll get something good out of this. I don't know. Let's see. One KXP bottle, recipe unlock silk, a carrot, enchant scroll evasion two, silver seed gold, enchant book efficiency one, splash potion, stone leggings, enchantment scroll bleeding two, skill increase, five K spiders, skill, knowledge ticket, fifteen K mining, that's pretty good. Fox spawner, let's use these. And then let's use these. Okay, I think I'm gonna end this video here. That loot pass was really fun. I definitely want to do some more in the future. So if you guys have enjoyed this video, give it a like. Don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.